What is going on everybody? Dar Sizzle and Puddin coming at ya. And if you're new to our channel, we are a Florida fishing couple. That's right, Dar Sizzle. And today we're destroying fish in shore. We're gonna show you exactly how to do it. Let's get right to the first fish. All right, Woo. get him, get him, get him. Get him, Sizzle. That's a good one, that's a good one. The thing is ripping. Woo! We are trolling all different kinds of lures. Some going deeper, some going a little less deeper. Solid, solid fish. We're gonna see what it is here. He's coming in. This video is brought to you by Hair Club today, our awesome sponsor. What's up? Woo! All right, we got fans over there yelling. <laughs> Let's get the first fish in the boat. Woohoo! Nice, Jack. Woo. Stud right there. So you can see the lure that this fish crushed. One of my top trolling lures for inshore trolling, or honestly, any saltwater trolling, these lures work. This is a Yazuri 3DB minnow, and that's gonna be in my Amazon store if you're interested, but this color slays the fish. That's bottom, hold on. No, that's a fish. Yeah, that's a fish. Nice. Right over that ledge, huh? Yeah, got a nice little ledge we found with the, the Lowrance depth finder and- Really light tackle setup. Got the rod doubled over. Another quality jack. Woo, hooked in the head. That's why I thought he was something crazy and weird, but he got hooked in the head. Holy Another screamer. Smokes. You should catch a fish now. I guess I, I gotta keep driving when we're facing into the wind like this. It's, the boat just turns right around. Wait, a lady? No. It's a shark. It's a shark? I've never caught a shark like this. Trolling Hold sharks. Up. Get him. What? Baby shark catching cook. <laughs> Good job, Sizzle. That is an that is a Atlantic sharp nose. That's what we catch when we're bottom fishing offshore. So that just goes to show you that there's so much clean water in here and bait and stuff that these guys are coming in from offshore. That is the first shark we ever caught trolling. Ever. Ever. In short. Crazy. Yeah. Ate that lure that the big jack ate, and he was just biting my net. Thought it was a net mess there, but he came right out. Woo! You want to come back in the boat there for a sec? <laughs> that was weird. Catch me a fish, Dar Sizzle. Trying, I'm trying, but it's been uh, slow since we caught all those fish trolling. Yeah, we, uh, you know, Darcy just finished up all your Christmas orders. Yes. Did you mention that before? I don't no, remember. I did not. But she I has been. I sat in the house for three weeks straight, <laughs> busting out orders, no fishing. Two of them with a cold. Yes. Uh, or maybe a light, light Omicron, I'm not yes. sure. Maybe a little light Omicron. But thank you guys Omicron. so much for all the orders and the support this year. You guys like just really yeah, made my awesome. year. It was awesome. Yeah kept me busy. Yeah, and then even today, she had, you know, today's Monday before Christmas and she was just finishing up some last minute orders. Yes. Calendars mostly. And I went to the post office and, you know, we got it really late today. So we weren't really expecting much. Just happy to get out here after we hadn't, hadn't fished all week. Yeah, it's been a while for sure. Um, but yeah, there are a few calendars left. So jump on that if you're interested. <laughs> yeah. When you see this. Got a couple left, so hurry up. Yeah. <laughs> Autographed. So we were just, and the current just died. Low dead current is probably the worst time you can fish. Like a high, high dead current is uh, a lot better, I think. And, but you know, we have caught some like really stud huge fish over the years on slack tides. So you never okay, you know, know. When someone tells you that, it, that doesn't mean anything. That just happened once. That's an that's anecdotal apparition. I said over the years. Yeah, of course, over the years. Yes. Everything happens over the years. But you know, just, you know, right now it's dead low. No, nothing's moving. And uh, so we're gonna try some different things. Yes. See if we can get, wrangle something up here, but uh, we're just happy to be out and happy to, to uh, be here with you guys. Yep, fishing my uh, traditional shrimp on a jig now for a while. Fishing different areas, caught a lot of little snappers. Uh, caught, Brian caught a bunch of catfish and small jacks and a blue runner. So that's about it for us. Yeah. Oh no! Oh no, he's there. There's right. another one, there's another one. Where? Right there. Where? Right there, that back one, green one, green one. That's bluefish, babe, I think. Keep it down there, keep it down. Woo, yeah, keep rod tip down. It's jumping fish, you don't want to lose them. I got a jack. Jacks, cool of jacks. Woo, Whoa. all right guys. I just had five million ladyfish follow this ladyfish. Oh yeah? Yes. No jumping from you. All right guys, No jumping. Awesome. <laughs> He's floating away. Oh. oh. All right guys, so that was really neat because we were coming down this intercoastal trolling again. And we're coming up that ledge I told you about before we found. And then we saw some mullet, a school of mullet actually. It was a little unusual this time of year. Yeah. And then right on the ledge. And then we hooked up immediately. So, you know, sometimes when you pay attention to what's going on out there, Sizzle. Doubled up. It, it actually works. Yeah, yep. we get doubled up. So that's not bad. Yeah. 
Brian spotted it and drove the boat correctly and pulled the yeah. lures right over that school. So the plan really came together. So that's the that's a little X wrap, a little Rapala we're pulling right now. We're doing our best. Yeah, we're just chipping away out. You know, nice day out here with my girlfriend. No complaints. No, we're not married. <laughs> Ten year anniversary coming up. <laughs> Living together, but that's okay. I'm free. Got not really home. free. Uh, well, <laughs> that's the, that's. That's the most confirmation. Oh, hooked up. Oh, good job, Sizzle. Sick. That, that was like the only time she's ever like positively identified we have a relationship in public. No way. <laughs> You're not really free. What are you talking about? You're crazy. Yeah, just started casting in this area. Yeah, that's how you do it, man. When Never you... hook a fish on camera. Oh, we do it all the time. You just called me a bad cameraman. No. This light setup. Just crush it. Troll for Jack. Nice. Another Another fish, guys. Another fish. Yeah, we got about 10 jacks now. Starting to chew. Yeah. It's perfect because I needed some crab trap bait. Right. He's pretty. He's got a really black tail. You're pretty. You're prettier. <laughs> With your hair club hair. Oh, my, yes. I got my hair club hair on today. Full of hair. Full, I got so much hair club hair. Full of hair. I actually, have, I have... Getting back to hair club real quick. Check them out. The full yeah. service salon. Men and women, hair or no hair. All right. That's right. <laughs> that fish is on. Jumping. Killing it. Might be a lady. Don't lose them. Incoming, Constant incoming, pressure. Incoming, incoming, Constant incoming, pressure. Incoming, incoming. Whoa. Woo, it's a monster. That's a nice one. Woo, woo, Easy. woo. Woo. <laughs> woo. It's a crazy fish. All right, Dawson, we got that ledge coming up. Get it out, get it out. Oh, we got to retire this one. Lip just broke off. This hook's bent. This hook just broke off. You have a new one over there? Oh, that one's used too. <coughs> Ow! Woo! That one took off screaming. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! That's a jack a right big there. Big fish! Big fish! Oh, there's bait blowing up over there on that calm water line. Okay. Bite's going on fire now as that current picks up. Nice jack on light tackle. Woo! Trolling is working in the mo winter months down here in Florida. Whoa! Most underrated fish inshore ever, these jacks, man. That's a good one. That is a good one. He was going nowhere. I'll do it real quick. Get him out. Right, let's get, get him out right now. Get him out right get now. Get him out right now. Get him out. Get him out. Get out. Okay, good job. Good job. Good job. Woo! Look at that. Rapala. Crushed it. Wow. Dude, that thing hit like a bonita when you're trolling offshore. Yeah. That was awesome. Awesome, dude, dude, man. Dude, you can just, you can just do this anywhere. If it's blown out offshore, you can troll inshore. That fish, what is that, like a seven pounder, five pounder? Five pounder. He Solid hit, five. He, he hit that lure, and that thing started screaming. Yeah, we're using like, what size reels are those? Shimano Van Ford 4000s or something? I think they're threes. Three thousands. Or maybe I'm wrong. We got you like bought. 15 pound braid on there. So when that Jack hits that thing, boat's going this way, Jack's going that way. It's like, <laughs> sick. Awesome. Nice fish. Sick. Get a big old belly on him. Hey, 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 I'm, I'm standing right here. Been eating well. That's me. You're talking about me or that fish? The fish. Back, Brian's <laughs> but put his back on the diet. Back on the diet. And, but talking about pudding, my birthday is the 28th. Just yes. So I, 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 I mean, I don't want to make a big deal out of it, but I'm just reminding you. No, it's his birthday month. Birthday month. I, I've, had, I've had the worst birthday month. Oh, come on. I haven't had any, I haven't had any birthday activities whatsoever. Are we going to do birthday activities with Omicron? Well, <laughs> we had two weeks of Omicron. Visiting, and then we had, <laughs> and then she just finished her things last night. So fish are chewing, hungry, hungry. And another one comes in the boat. This one is much shorter. This one's kept about 50 feet directly behind the boat, and the other two, and basically our little L uh, tees or outriggers, those are further back, about 100 foot or so. Yeah. So where can they get those tees? Where do you? We get those at a yard sale, I, I think. I have no idea where we got that. We have them on our Amazon store. No, because there's no such thing. Oh, well, I know you. I know we got some nice, expensive ones on the other boat, and we got those at. Uh, I'll put the thing right here. Oh, jeez. Oh, get it, babe. Look at that. Another stud. <laughs> Pick it up. Another stud. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Running. All quality fish today, though. All those jacks are nice size. Our engine is so loud. Yeah, sorry. Each other think. 
Sorry, y'all. One day we'll get a new engine, but for now, we can't afford it. <laughs> Been in rods all day, though. So interesting, though, how the lures are crushing it, and we couldn't catch anything on a shrimp. Jeez, you fought like crazy. Woo! Come on, buddy. Woo, flip them out, flip them out. Good job. Stud. Multitasking. <laughs> oh, he is on there. Oh. Woo! That's not a Spanish. Yes! Is That's not a, a keeper, baby though. Spanish. It's not a keeper. We gotta get him right out. Hurry up, hurry up. They still like to swim. Yeah, they need to keep constantly moving. That's a baby Spanish mackerel. He is really pretty. Gorgeous fish. Ate the Rapala. There we go. Took off. Nice job. You nice don't job. want to touch those fish. Yeah. You gotta keep moving at all times or they die quickly. So, another species! And this lens water all over the camera. All right, guys, getting dark, we gotta head in. But all those uh, lures we use today, which Darcy uses every time we troll and we slayed fish for years with them, they're all gonna be at Darcy's Amazon store. He has a little beer roll of them, uh, but definitely check out those lures. But thank you for joining us on this adventure today. It was a short adventure for us, but we caught a ton of fish, yeah. so cannot complain. Thank you guys for watching, and until our next adventure, follow, follow your dreams, dreams and, and keep, keep on catching. catching.